guys, welcome back to the Minimalist Bujo Challenge throwback. Um, I, <laughs> I still can't find my handy cam. Um, I packed it, I brought it, I don't know where it is. So, we're on my phone again, but I did find a mount, so uh, it won't be quite as shaky this time, hopefully. Um, but I am just going to kind of show you what I've been doing in my sort of minimalist uh, interim setup here um, that I showed you in last week's video. Um, because I haven't had time to plan anything more elaborate, and I still, as you see, have not time had time to move away from my Christmassy inserts and uh, dashboards and things. Because um, yeah, it's still it's still been crazy, but fortunately I am feeling much better. Thank you for your concern. Um, and yeah, so I've just been using this really basic uh, spread setup in this field notes. It's just a basic. Uh, grid field notes the craft cover. I did get some cool designer covers, but I figured I would just use the last uh, plain one I had uh, For this because you know, I don't want to like use one of the fancy ones to not do anything fancy inside, you know Anyway, so this is just this sort of to-do list that uh, is kind of running to-do list and I've been checking through this um, every day or so to see what I can do off it and adding things to it as I think of them. Um, I still need to find, I just need to go to my lady. And <laughs> January setup is at the beginning here of my list and I haven't gotten to that yet. Uh, there's a couple things that I've like started but haven't finished, like I want to trim the doormat. I did it like halfway. Um, yeah, and I've actually, as you see, run out of room on this spread and moved on to a, a, another page of this. Also you'll notice I don't have an index. Um, maybe I can use some of this for that if I decide there's anything in here that I need access to later, but I haven't numbered the pages or anything. Anyway, these are all just dailies. Uh, I was using it for like some notes. That time I needed a f to make a phone call last week. Turns out they weren't even open. Um, yeah. Let's see. Then yes, this is the to buy for house. I've bought some of the things and added some other things to it. And I have not had a chance yet to sort of set up a grand master plan for the office layout. Maybe this weekend. Um, I, I want to just make sure that I have like the space measured properly so that I don't get a desk that's too big. And then I just want to go to Ikea and get a desk so I can set things up for real. Because like I said, I am set up on my old desk. You'll notice this is the same, same desk I've been using for this whole time, but um, I want to get uh, maybe a white one. Um, but I don't want to like get too comfortable and like settled in. Like I don't have things running through the hole in the back of the desk because I figure it's just going to be coming apart again really soon. So um, I don't want to. I can't like set up the stuff on the walls in the office until I am sure that I like where all the furniture is. So maybe this weekend. I hope we'll see. Um, this meal plan kind of went the way of, I don't know, my flu in my life. Um, I got sick on Friday morning and so I did not end up making this, this recipe which I already had the ingredients for until Sunday, Saturday. Um, and so these other things we didn't end up eating at all so I just kind of crossed that off. I did sort of fill this page with meal ideas, I forget if this was here last week. Um, but just sort of things that I know how to cook, things that I'm comfortable cooking that are easy enough um, so that when I am making my um, meal plans I can just sort of look here and um, this will I'm sure get much prettier um, when it gets moved into like a long-term collections insert once I have my whole setup finalized but for now this is what I have because um, I need a place to write it all down and then this is the meal plan for this week uh, we're only eating at home Wednesday, Thursday, Friday and then Saturday, we might do leftovers, and this might be Sunday, we'll see. Um, but yeah, I made these buffalo chicken baked potatoes for dinner tonight, and they were delicious. Um, these notes over here are things that I still need to buy for the, like I bought these things already, um, just today. Things that still need to be purchased that I either forgot to get at the store, or need to get from a different store. Anyway, this is the overflow of that to-do list. Um, you know, you know, change some addresses, and... I am playing my mom's birthday. Mom, if you see this, which I think you might, um, I need to plan your birthday. And then this is my daily for today. Um, I think this is going to get 
Yeah, let's actually plan live, shall we? Um, tomorrow, or when you see this, Thursday, which is the 11th, because time flies and we're almost halfway into the month already. Let's change of address list. I need to find that in my, um, my old bullet journal. It was like the very first spread of my very first bullet journal was, um, a list of places I needed to change my name after I got married. So I'm going to use that spread to sort of populate a list to, to check off of places where I need to change my address because I've, I've only changed like one place so far. Because um, we're moving out of my in-laws house, we're still going over there like every day, the dog's spending the day there because my father-in-law is there most days. Um, so like it's really close and we can get our mail from there. So there's no urgency to changing our address because we're not going to miss anything that's sent to the old address. But I still, we still need to change it in a lot of places, you know, officially. So it's our billing address and, you know, yeah. Uh, add that to the list here because I'm not sure. You know how it is. You move and you misplace things. So just like I've misplaced my camera, I've also misplaced that bullet journal. It's not where I thought it was. Um, so let's see. I need to plan the summer lecture for MH because time is moving very quickly. Much more quickly than I expected. And then we'll look at these two to-do lists. Um... I think I'm just going to make a list of things that need to be taken from the old house to the new house. Um, so I need the Wi-Fi sampler. Maybe I might post a picture of this. I might... <laughs> I have been so bad about Instagram the last, like, forever. I'm just not an Instagram person. Apparently, I thought I could be, but maybe I'm just not. But I will try to remember to post a picture on Instagram when I'm working on this. I have this cross-stitch sampler that shows, that um, gives you the, the Wi-Fi password, and I'm kind of proud of it, um, and I might, once the stitching is all out, post a picture on Instagram and make sure that it's not showing anything uh, too important. Uh, and so keep an eye on that. If you want to, it's Ganchi underscore. Um, toilet brush. Really exciting stuff. Salmon, because the salmon's still there and it needs to defrost, and then just, I don't know, anything else that I see lying around that I can just bring over. Uh, yes. Alright, I think I might sort of take it easy. I do need to grade homework. That's on MH as well, by Hogwarts.com. Um, and, yeah, nothing too strenuous, I guess. And then, hopefully, we're going to get a good amount of things done on Saturday. I should probably um, start as I'm thinking about stuff, because I am sort of, like, as I go throughout my day, going, oh, I should get that done on Saturday. I'm going to start adding those things as I think of them to my to-do list here, so that I uh, have that ready to go on Saturday, and I can just start getting stuff done. Uh, mostly, it's, like, unpacking some boxes, but... Also, like, I can't really unpack them until I have the office set up, so I have somewhere to put it. You know how it is. It's all just sort of this nested to-do list. But, uh, in the meantime, I'm more or less uh, on top of things, thanks to my basic setup here. Thank you guys for tuning in. I know this hasn't been very exciting, but I do appreciate you all sticking around uh, while I go through all of this whole moving stress um, and yeah, having you guys as uh, sort of <laughs> my accountability has been helpful. So thank you. Um, I will see you guys in the next one. It should be this weekend. And yeah, I shouldn't have any trouble keeping at least the schedule of a basic video uh, three times a week. And even if they're not like involved or exciting, at least you get to hear my voice and my stuffy nose and my... Uh, <laughs> <clears throat> suppressed coughs. All right, you guys stay healthy and stay warm wherever you are, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye! <laughs>